Hi, yeah, it's me again. Um, I'm just wondering whether Dr. Garu really understood the full extent of what was going on in Harrogate in Signet, Signet Hospital, you see. Um, maybe because he didn't listen to me and I didn't fully explain to him what was going on there or to the people in York led to what has happened now in York. Um, <clears throat> the thing is, it was a private run hospital that I was taken to <coughs> for no good reason. Um, no, there was a bit of a good reason because I had been harassed a lot, um, actually. So maybe someone thought that I needed to uh, go for a short trip away to kind of uh, get people off my back. Um, but um, there was a downstairs and an upstairs. The upstairs was, was full, of, full of people who supposedly had mental health difficulties. The downstairs was full of people who were apparently paying um, to um, be detoxed from drugs problems. Um, and they would come sometimes all the way from London and pay to stay at the clinic for about three days to be detoxed. Um, now, um, so sometimes um, they were apparently put under general anaesthetic. So like I was a bit worried about that. Um, but also there were people in the mental health part of uh, the hospital who had come all the way from Liverpool. Like there were loads of Liverpoolians um, trying to get space at this Harrogate hospital. Um, well, I actually met a Liverpudlian uh, called Paul and he was saying, oh, things aren't as rough in Harrogate as they are in Liverpool. And then suddenly they started sending everybody from Liverpool there. So uh, and then and then um, sometimes people only stayed there about three days and they'd just have to get in a taxi and be supposedly driven all the way back to Liverpool. And, uh, like, it was really worrying uh, for all of us, actually. Um, because, like, if nobody came to visit them, um, then we were all quite worried what would happen to each other. Um, and, uh, fortunately, uh, a lawyer came to visit me, um, both at um, Signet Hospital and at... Uh, at Bootham when I'd arrived there which was very kind of him indeed and he was from I mean I know that maybe um you know I I was a lit a bit let down at the tribunal um by by the lady lawyer that I had but like at least I did get some sort of representation I mean at least she was there and could witness um what was happening so yes that was the uh g s solicitors i, f I briefly forget their name uh g, s g t stewart in uh, leeds okay then bye for now bye